Listo. Apunte. Dispare. Tomorrow. The next day. The day after that. I will be out there. You haven't been tried yet. Neither had he. Under the decrees of Dios. It is enough that I was a friend of General Ruiz. He has lots of friends. They can't kill them all. I shall try to take comfort in that fact. When they stand me up against the wall, senor. Perhaps I shall even cry, Viva Vicente! But I doubt it. Once, I would have cut out the heart of any man who called me a coward. But now, senor, I shall be honest with you. I sit here and wish I had some important information the government wanted. Or some compadre I could betray. Anything. Which I could use to bargain with Captain Chavez to spare my life. I don't want to die. Not like that. No one does. And you won't, senor. Government doesn't want your life. It wants Ruiz. Well, they won't get it. Your family won't give him up? No. And you won't ask them to? No. I don't understand that, senor. I think I admire it. But I don't understand it. telling me there's nothing you can do or nothing you will do? All I can do is sympathize, Jared. But surely the State Department would intervene on Heath's behalf if you requested it. I have requested it, Victoria. Senator, are you completely aware that Heath's life is at stake? If it was my decision, I'd send the Army to Rio Blanco to get Heath if necessary. But it isn't my decision. I'll do what I can, but I can't do any more. What about the General? What's been his reaction? We haven't told him yet. You haven't told him. In the name of heaven, why not? Because if he knew that Heath were in jail because of him, he'd give himself up to the Diaz regime immediately. Don't you think he has a right to make that choice? We wanted to speak to you first. You see, if Vicente returns to Mexico, he'll never get out of prison alive. I understand your loyalty to him, Victoria, but you have an obligation to Heath, too. I'm aware of that. Of course you are, Victoria. But you're trying to do the impossible. It's Heath or the General, but not both. And is it such a difficult choice, Victoria? Heath is your son. Forget the General. Well, thank you very much for your time and advice. And you're quite right. We should forget this, Cynthia. Jared, we'd better be getting home. Senator? But you're not going to, are you? No. No, because we don't believe it is either or. We think we can save both Heath and Vicente. At least we'll try. Thank you. Guard! Guard! Sergeant. What's the matter? This man is sick. Well? Well, get him a doctor. There is no doctor in Rio Blanco.
And even if there were, I wouldn't trouble him with a man who goes in front of the firing squad in the morning. Something wrong with the food, senor? Not a thing. If you like garbage, I wouldn't slop pigs with that. Because you come from a rich country. I've heard your streets are paved with gold. But we are a poor country. Our people cannot be so particular. And we cannot be wasteful. Eat your supper, senor. Eat it, or I will have my men feed it to you. Sergeant. Well, here. You eat it. scenes from next week's concluding episode of Legend of a General. Your on the table. for two weeks from tomorrow at the district court in Hermosillo. Well, I thought I might point out to you that if you receive the death penalty, it will be carried out immediately. What are you doing? 